Understanding Henpecked, a tale of domestic dynamics. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we dive into the fascinating world of English phrases and their meanings. Today, we're going to unpack a very interesting term, henpecked. You may have heard it in conversations or movies, and it often carries a humorous or negative connotation. So, what does it really mean to be henpecked? Let's find out together and add another phrase to your growing English vocabulary. The term henpecked describes a situation where a wife constantly criticizes or gives orders to her husband, and the husband, in turn, tends to obey to avoid conflict. The imagery here is quite vivid. Think of how a hen pecks at the ground for food. Now, imagine a person being pecked at or nagged in a similar persistent way. This phrase can be applied broadly to anyone in a submissive position under someone else's control. But traditionally, it refers to a married man with a particularly assertive or dominant wife. Understanding where phrases come from can often help us remember them better. The phrase, henpecked, has its roots in the animal kingdom. Hens are known for their pecking behavior, and this characteristic was anthropomorphized to describe similar behavior in human relationships. It's an old-fashioned term that has been in use since at least the 17th century and reflects societal views on gender roles that are not as prevalent today. When do we use the word henpecked? It's important to know the context in which a word or phrase is used to use it correctly. Henpecked is often used in a social or humorous context to describe the dynamics of a relationship. For example, John doesn't come out with us anymore. He's a bit henpecked, I'm afraid. Whenever they argue, it's clear who's the boss at their house, Mike is totally henpecked. However, be cautious when using this term, as it can be offensive or outdated to some. It's always good to understand the sensitivity of the terms we use in our daily language. This term has also made its way into books, movies, and TV shows. Characters portrayed as henpecked husbands often provide comic relief, although sometimes they can also draw sympathy for their situation. These portrayals can serve as a way for writers to explore and critique the power dynamics within relationships and sometimes to challenge traditional stereotypes. And there you have it. A complete look at the term, henpecked. We hope this video has given you some clarity on the meaning and use of this phrase and perhaps even sparked some thoughts on relationship dynamics. Remember, Learning a language is not just about words and grammar, it's also about the culture and stories behind the words. Keep learning and stay curious. Until next time, take care and happy learning.